Okay, this is just a, <clears throat> a quick recording to, to make sure I've got on record something that, that happened about 15 minutes ago. Uh, at the moment it's about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I've just had a, a bath uh, for whatever reason. Uh, woke up late, didn't sleep last night, all the rest of it, no big deal. Uh, but while I was in the bath, um, I'm relaxed obviously, I'm in a kind of semi-meditative state. Uh, I don't know what kind of brain waves I was I was kind of accessing, but there's a, a phenomenon going on. So I was thinking about where to do my shopping. Normally I would go to a, a supermarket which is walking distance, just up the road, two minutes away, called Herons. And while I was in the bath, I was thinking about going somewhere else, a place called Iceland, which is in Gateshead. And it's a bit further, it's a bigger, it's a longer walk. It's not somewhere I would normally think about going, because I can get most of my stuff from Herons. But, but at this particular point, I'm in the bath. Um, I'm thinking about where to do my shopping. So you've got to understand the context of this. Um, where I live is a block of flats. I live on the ground floor uh, by the lift. So there's a door to the, the back of the building and some steps going down to, to the entrance. And I'm next to the lift. So I, I, if you want to come in to the building, you've got to go to the lift. And I'm, I'm right there. So I hear some of the conversations sometimes in the lift lobby, in the entrance. And about, about literally about 30 seconds after I'd been thinking about going shopping at Iceland, there's a couple of guys waiting for the lift, having a conversation. And one of them says to the other, have you ever been to Iceland? So there you go. There's a telepathy experiment you can do in the bath without even trying. And if it's repeatable, which I think it might be, uh, in this in this context at least, you'd have to do this. You'd have to be within hearing distance of conversations outside. So that would be the stipulation for the experiment, because it's an experiment kind of using people who are outside of the building that I don't know. I don't know who this was. I don't really know the neighbours here. So because I've only been here five months so here's the deal if, if you wanted to set up a, a telepathy experiment and you happen to have a bath that's within earshot of an entrance lobby to a block of flats or a lift lift lobby that has people going backwards and forwards on a fairly regular basis because there's not much point in doing a telepathy experiment if there aren't people around because you're never going to know the end result. You're never going to hear the conversation. Uh, but that's that's the experiment. I think that's a pretty insightful piece of lying around in the bath for an hour. And uh, I'm going to use it as a story on my radio show, but I wanted to document it just to make sure that uh, that I don't forget. And I might even just use this recording on Saturday. The, the radio show, if you want to have a listen is at revolution.radio uh, studio b on saturdays uh, it's 11 a.m on the east coast of america and it's 4 p.m british time at the moment because we're british summertime uh, there's a slight variation for a couple of weeks on either end when the when the clocks change but that's where it is at the moment so i look forward to seeing you there uh, I talk about this type of thing on the radio show all the time and uh, it's part of what I do but well, you're welcome to come along uh, tell me the the results of your experiment if you do if you do take up the the challenge tell me the results let me know if it happens for you